self-care can be super simple. I think a lot of people think self-care, they have to engage in big activities, whether that's going to the gym for an hour or doing yoga or meditation for long periods of time, but self-care can be something like going and having a coffee with a friend. Um, it can be having a bubble bath, baking cookies, doing something small for yourself, whether that's coloring or playing a board game, playing a video game, or watching your favorite TV show. Um, self-care can be really simple, just something that can bring a smile to a student's face. One thing I do uh, are like breathing exercises. I find that like just helps like uh, if I'm ever stressed like I don't realize how like tense I am until I do the breathing exercises that I'm like a lot more relaxed. But um, other things are just eating well, exercising, um, spending time with your family and friends as well. Like you don't want to spend all your time dedicated to like one thing, you know, just kind of spread yourself out and you know, um, that'll definitely help as well. Myself, I like to paint. I like to make soup and I like to drink a lot of tea. I also just like, I like to spend a lot of time with my friends as well while we're not studying just to kind of de-stress and be able to relax and just have someone to talk to. For myself, I do a lot of exercise. So physical activity, eating is really well, is really good. Getting enough sleep, that's a huge thing. So making sure that I know for myself I need eight hours of sleep. So making sure that I get that. Um, I have animals. Um, I have six cats, so they take a lot of stress away from me. So going home, that's uh, um, you know I really look forward to that because I get snuggles and, and hugs and all of that. Um, I find physical activity is huge, and I notice that if I don't keep a good schedule with my physical activity, I can feel it affect my mental health. And um, also just balancing. So school is really important, and it's really important to me too, but now I understand the balance between like your home life and your school life and seeing your friends and family too. Whenever it's exam time, I try to eat healthy as much as I can. Because uh, if I eat healthy, then uh, automatically you will get good sleep. Um, I guess at least every person, sh every person should have seven to eight hours of sleep regularly. And during exam season, I know it's very important to catch up on everything and stuff like that, but still, um, sleep is really important.